Next story just continues to develop new at six here. Scientists are investigating whether a York County paper mill that is being blamed for emitting a foul odor is also hurting its next door neighbor, the Catawba River. That river forms the eastern border of the new Indy paper mill in Catawba and state environmental regulators have ordered the mill to clean up its air following thousands of complaints. WCNC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner is live for us at Lansford Canal State Park. So, Brandon, why are scientists concerned now? Well, Vanessa, they've been getting a lot of reports of foam forming along the surfaces of the Catawba River, particularly here at the park. Now, the paper mill is also about three and a half miles upstream from here, and they believe that is the source of the foam. We're taking you back to high school science class. This is the scientific method come to life. The question, what's causing this foam to form in spots along the Catawba River? The hypothesis, according to the Catawba River keepers, Brandon Jones, the new Indy paper mill is releasing more surfactants into the river. Those are substances that can create bubbles. The foam itself is just kind of a nuisance and it's unsightly, um, but we're concerned about what's causing the foam and then seeing if that has any other impacts to the, to the health of the environment. Now comes the experiment. All right, see you in a bit. This is the second of three launches into the Catawba River. Jones and two DHEC scientists ride to different sites along the river, submerging a probe to record data and scooping out cups of river water. This is one of two simultaneous scientific processes playing out at New Indy. The other, the focus for thousands of people, is in the air. Specifically, the stinky odor, DHEC says, New Indy is spewing out from its plant. Late last week, the state ordered the company to put together a plan to reduce odor levels. Back on dry land, DHEC will analyze these samples, and in a few weeks, Jones hopes they'll have their conclusion. Everybody has been kind of looking at this and collaborating, um, and we are optimistic that we finally have it figured out. New Indy has not responded to our requests for comment. DHEC will be holding a news briefing tomorrow afternoon to provide an update on their odor investigation. Live along the Catawba River, Brandon Goldner, WCNC Charlotte. Wow, a lot of layers here. Brandon, thank you so much.